I got something great to show you. Watch this. Let's take a look at Congressman Jeff Jackson. I don't like this guy. I don't like his approach at all. I'm actually going to call him Congressman Nobody. He really wants to be somebody, but I think he's a nobody. All right. So last week, I told you that what I've seen as a new member of Congress is that the super angry voices in Congress are mostly faking it, that what they're really doing is acting angry as a way to audition to get onto certain news shows, and that those shows are in the business of selling outrage to their audience. Didn't mention a name, didn't mention a party. Well, one of those shows decided to respond to my observation directly, and in the process, became a perfect example. Watch. The same people who act like maniacs during the open meetings are suddenly calm and rational during the closed ones. I don't think Matt Gates acts like a maniac in those committee hearings. The same goes for Marjorie Taylor Greene. These people, if you actually listen to them, are not maniacs. They're very, very smart. And there's a lot to be angry about, oh, by the way. Uh, oh, and here's Lauren Boebert. Is this a maniac? Okay, so look, here's what's happening. Now they're going into overdrive to defend themselves, but also to defend the particular politicians that this show relies on to sell you outrage like this. He's a mind reader, huh? He sees into the soul of everybody. Well, I've been around some of these members of Congress, the ones he's talking about, the ones who make a big splash on social media, and they're also in committee and they're great people. And oh, by the way, very reasonable. You can actually do business with them. And they're not saying crazy things in these hearings. All right. Last word from Congressman Nobody. What I love about this, about communicating with you directly, is that the incentives are different. They can be positive. They can be about speaking to you with respect and real information and in a normal tone of voice. Mm, okay. I'll say this respectfully. Uh, you're Congressman Nobody. You just said those people uh, don't believe in what they're saying. That's offensive to them and actually to me. These issues are real and you're the good guy, right? Because you don't, I don't know, because you're boring on social media. All right. Congratulations. You made a splash today. Go back to obscurity and uh, who knows, maybe he's president of the United States someday. Am I going to have to eat these words? I don't think so. I'll be right back. I rest my case.